One of my favorite things to do with limits is just plug it in, but sometimes you can't just plug it in. So here's one that you can't just plug it in. We have the limit of 3x over x plus 2 as uh, x approaches negative 2 from the right. It'd be great if we could just plug in uh, negative 2. Let's see, like this. We have negative 2 plus 2, but... Uh, and three times negative two. That'd be great because it, we'd have negative six over zero, but that is bad. You can't have zero in the, denom in the denominator. So you have to actually use your brain. Uh, welcome to calculus. Hello, everybody. Now we could graph it or we could, th we could just think, think a little bit. I believe in you. Oh, somehow I got a ruler on here. That's pretty cool. All right. So if we think uh, negative two from the right, well, if we use like one point, not negative, one point, nine, 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 what's going to happen? So this would be, this would be three times negative two, basically, right? Uh, over, that's a negative 1.999, right? Repeating uh, plus two. Okay, this is going to be just a really, really small, very, very small, like a really small fraction, you know, negative six over one over one. Uh, you know, one, 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 you know, like this. It's it's a really small fraction, but it's positive because we're coming from the right. And so that two is greater than 1.999, right? Well, that just means it's going to multiply up here. So what's negative six times the biggest number you've ever heard of? Uh, I call it negative infinity. Boom. Way to go. All right. I'll get you another one.